All right, listen, I know the patch is gonna drop this week, probably, according to rumors. And I also know a lot of people are gonna drop MMR when the patch drops. At least that's the case for me a lot of the times because I'm too cocky and I'm playing too much Dota. So I'm gonna give you several tips that I'm doing that I have learned in the last years about myself, how I should play and what should I play to prevent myself to like going to an insane losing streak and losing like one or two game MMR because of a patch, so whatever. Number one, stick to your heroes. When you play three or four or five heroes mainly, stick to them in the new patch. Don't start like playing OP heroes that you think that are OP, just stick to what you play the best. Even though they seem like nerfed as fuck, it doesn't matter. Just try to stick for them, f see how they feel, if they feel good, keep playing them. If they don't feel good, you can start stopping after you lost like two games in a row. That's like one big rule you should always like use. Play two games. When you lose two, stop for the day or play normal games or go to the smurf or whatever. When you win two games, you should keep going because you feel good obviously. And if you win one and you lose one game, you should play a third game and whatever happens in this game, Go for either more when you win or stop for the day if you lose. It's like very important if you want to grind MMR. You should not overplay. Like even myself, last last week I've played like, I don't know, 30 games. And I think I lost like 25. I actually enjoyed it a lot. I also was streaming a lot. So I wanted to play. I didn't want to stop. I lost like 500 MMR in like 3 days. But I can live with it. Like I will grind the MMR and I will drop the MMR every fucking weekend. It doesn't really matter. For you guys, you want to grind the MMR and you don't want to lose it. So prevent yourself to go to these like despair losing streaks. Try to stick whatever you play good or you feel good on. Number 2. It's like the classic. Whenever the patch drops, don't start spamming pubs or ranked games. Play normal or play a new smurf. If you have one, obviously. If you don't, then just try to play normal. Play some custom games. You will also learn how the heroes play or how the heroes feel. Like, if you start ranked right when the patch drops, a lot of people will test shit. A lot of people don't know what's going on. Everybody's, like, kind of clueless. I don't know why, but it's every, every time a patch drops, everybody doesn't know how to play Dota anymore. So just prevent yourself of spamming the ranks, trust me. I've done it a lot of times. I've done it even in my like recalibration games back in the day and I lost like 1.5k MMR in like one week. So yeah, try to like force yourself to either stop the pl uh, stop the game if you don't feel good or try to play in your second account or whatever you have. Last but not least, the third point that could also be the first point. Read the patch. For some people it might be boring but if you get a small understanding of the patch and if you read it like several times you will understand what's gonna come to you before you join the game even you can even read the patch and make some notes about the important things like buffs for your hero or some economic changes like bounties are only giving half gold or 10 bounties are spawning before minute 10 or whatever like anything just take notes so you will think about them in the game and you can maybe abuse them before other people do it. It is a really hard point, I know that, but if you do that, you will be a step ahead of your enemies. And you might abuse it because, as I said, there's a new patch. People are really struggling and clueless what they want to do and what they need to do. So they will start experimenting. Everybody's like bored of the old patch, so they want to go for new stuff. And if you find something before other people do it, you might actually win several ranked games because of it. But you should not rush spamming them. You're gonna probably have like two and a half years again until Valve is gonna drop a next patch. So take it easy, do it step for step. Don't rush, don't stress yourself out. And you will have success with your MMR or you will have success with Dota and you will have fun and enjoy it. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. I hope some of these tips might help you. And if they help, let me know it in the comments. Bye bye.